what's going on guys? Thanks for tuning in to CBTV. My name is Kevin. My name is Daniel. And we're Daniel. your hosts. So we'll be going over everything from mod reviews to juice reviews to interviewing shop owners and we're going to be teaching you guys about vape safety. Today we're going to do our first review, The Prism by Deus Mod. At first glance, it is a beautiful mod that does come in three finishes, brass, shot blasted, and stainless steel. The top cap and the bottom cap have beautiful engravings, and not to mention the bottom button is really cool. It has a really nice engraving, which is Korean and Filipino influence. It's a really sturdy mod when you feel it in your hands. The finish is great on it, by the way. Oh, and it's a telescopic mod. So it fits all your batteries from 18350 all the way to 18650. You want to break it down a little bit for them? Alright. Initially when you feel the device, it feels great in your hands. First off you have the button. The throw of the device is really really firm. The machining on it is pretty on point. If you lock it up, it has this locking ring right over here, which is really, really smooth. It is really smooth. Um, if you open it up, if you look at the contacts that we already have broken up right over here, you can tell that, you can see that it's all silver. It's actually pure silver contacts, guys. It's not silver plated, it is all silver, which means this bad boy should hit really hard which is why we have these two atomizers sitting right over here to test it out. F it hard. Now it's the time to test the performance of this bad boy. Yes. Okay. So I'm gonna put on this voltage meter. Four point oh seven. That is the current charge of the battery. We're gonna throw this 0.34 ohmed Patriot onto here and we'll see what it reads under load. Three point five eight, which is roughly about 0.5. That's generally what you would say that is a hard hitting mod. That's, that's a pretty good hitting mod. Yes, definitely is. All right, now, now it's time to is. test the super sub ohm build. It's a 0.11 build, guys. Now, we don't recommend using this build on any battery. You do want to use the right batteries. Not using the right batteries can end in a catastrophic failure, which would not be fun. Mm -hmm. At all. Oh. Right now, the battery is once again at 4.06 now. <coughs> now we're gonna throw on the Nimbus, which is the full one. Woo! Wow. 3.1. So that means this dropped on a 0 0.11 build is still less than one volt. Wow. That is pretty crazy in my books. That's a pretty hard hitting mod. It is. I'm actually vaping on mine right now, my Patriot would have cotton build dual micro coils 26 gauge and you know it, it I like it I mean I've been using it all day I mean it's really nice if you're looking for a hardening hey, mod it's a nice this is mod. it right here if you guys are looking for this mod it is available for you at new age vapors so contact them um, if you're also in a shop in the OC area that wants to carry this, you can also contact New Age Paper for more information on wanting to carry it in your store. Thanks guys for tuning in to the very first episode of CVTV. Make sure you subscribe and there will be a lot more to come. Now if you want to discuss more about this episode, make sure you come find us at www.calivapers.com and sign up if you're not already signed up. And for any vendors or anyone that wants us to do a review for you, make sure you contact us at contact at and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. That's it for today. Make sure you come out to the OC Vapors meet and we'll see you there. Peace. Peace. Lower's card miser. Well,
Emily Cannon, no red. Do you have any? 